Did you guys see the controversy? Elon Musk got turned away from the Bergheim? <laughs> which which, I, which I, I, I respect. Because I think this is exactly what Bergheim should be doing. You'd be turning guys like Elon Musk and me away, okay? This is... <laughs> I've been turned away five times from the Bergheim. I can't have gotten in. Has anyone gotten to the Bergheim here? Yeah. yeah. Oh, you sir? What, what's the secret? Um, I... It was really cold outside, and I, I was waiting for some sun. It was really, it was really cold outside. I had some tight pants on, and you could just see the size of my schlong. And they were like, "In this temperature, you're in, bro." Okay, we gotta get this guy in. All right, there you go. Yeah, six hours. What happened? My face was like, I don't give a fuck. I need to feel warm. Either reject me or accept me. So my face was like really relaxed and confident. Because I saw that some people got rejected, they were like really, really stressed and they were like, they were really desperate. Because everybody was wearing really black. So the, I think the clothing was pretty much, everybody got it right. But they were still rejecting people. So Very interesting. With expression. See, that's the, the exact opposite of what I did. I said, hey, I said, how's it going, bro? And I said, actually, no, how's it going, fam? Because, like, you know, because because bro is gender, but fam is not. Can I get in now? <laughs> and he was like, no. <laughs> well, that's a fair move, sir. That's actually very fair. All right. Uh, the first time I shaved my balls, I thought that it is normal after you shave your balls. I, I shave my balls before I shave my face, okay? Just a little bit of context. So it made a lot... This is how my d d development worked. <laughs> So I saw a lot of uh, commercials about shaving your face on TV, okay? But I never had the need to shave my face. And they say that if you shave your face, you should use aftershave on your face. Yes? <laughs> so the first time I shaved my balls, I used aftershave on my balls. Now I don't know if you know, but now you know. There's, there's, some, there's some aggressive retreat. This is what happens. <laughs> Alright, that was, that, that was my little ball footnote. <sighs> the pain haunts me to today. <laughs> okay. I am originally from Romania. Yes, I am not German. Did you think I was German? No. <laughs> well, this guy's got too much energy output to be German, okay? All Germans now are conserving energy for next winter because of Russia. <laughs> we're going in strong from the start, okay? We're gonna, we're gonna do a lot of pipeline jokes tonight, okay? So you're the young lady from Mexico, what's your name? Sara. Sara, okay, you've come from Mexico, from Mexico City, from Guadalajara, are you from uh, Monterrey, huh? Monterrey. Monterrey, yeah, represent, okay, very good. The last one, I, the, 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 I only had one more city or one more region, which was Sudan Juarez, but that was from Narcos, that's how it counts. Very good, you've come here from Monterrey to, to study, to work, to baila? To study. <laughs> study. Two weeks in Mexico, guys, I'm fluent, all right? Very good, so you guys all study 3D animation, yes? So what, what kind of things do you guys want to animate? Do you have any, do you have any things you want to animate, sir, Swiss guy, that I have not yet asked for your name, but I'm assuming you have one? What's your name? David. David, okay. Very good. Well, what do you want to animate? I mean, working for Disney would be cool. For Disney? Working for Disney would be cool? That's good. Very good. Good round of applause for him. Yeah, Disney. It's good. No, it's good to have. See, in Switzerland, you can dream high, okay? You can dream high. You can dream very high. I was having a conversation with one of my Romanian comedian friends the other day. I was like, you know, what's, what's the dream for you, man? What's the dream for you? And he was like, you know, maybe one day I could be a... A bad guy in a Hollywood movie. <laughs> like, just a tiny henchman works as well. I don't have to be the biggest guy, you know? Very good. Disney, very good. You know, I, I was watching Encanto recently. Anybody watched Encanto? Is that a Disney movie? Yeah. You guys liked Encanto? Yeah. Okay, we don't talk about Jada. Okay. <laughs> Alright, yeah, somebody saw watch that show. But the thing is, I was thinking, you know what we don't have? We don't have any Eastern European Disney princess. Huh? You want to make that a thing? <laughs> How would that even look? We don't know. But probably she has like a stray dog as a pet. This is... Very good. <laughs> Those guys are poor. <laughs> when are you guys born? What, what year are you guys born? Are you guys born after 9-11? Yeah. Oh, so this is your first war. <laughs> oh, you're from Turkey now. We got war all the time in Turkey. All right, very good. Where are you guys from over here? You, sir, you're... you're 
Sorry? Where are you from? Switzerland. We got oh, he got this guy. No, 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 we have no wars. We have we got they got a stance on this war at the moment. Yes, they froze a lot of assets for Putin. Am I right? Well done, sir. Yeah. All right. What about yourself, sir? I'm from Spain. Oh, Spain. Spain's a nice place to be at the moment. You know, you guys also know war. Okay. Yourself? Uh, India, but I grew up in Abu Dhabi. Oh, you were here before. Where did you yeah. here before? I remember. Yeah. I was like, oh, Abu Dhabi. We should make the show paint. <laughs> <laughs> Okay, so you guys are a group of students here. What do you guys all study? What, what you, let's start with Switzerland. I mean, we are. We're just studying, studying the same thing. Ah, studying, oh, it's all 3D printing. It's 3D design. Yeah. 3D animation. <laughs> I, guys, I remember half of it, okay? Okay. Okay. This would have gotten me late if this was a Tinder date, okay? <laughs> it's funny because it's true. All right. Ina is a very famous international Romanian musician. I don't really listen to her stuff, but I used to live in Asia for a while, and every time I would meet somebody in Asia, or from like India, Pakistan, Bangladesh, they'd be like, oh my God, they're from Romania? Do you know Ina? Do you know Ina? And this guy from Bangladesh, she goes, you are from the country of the artists that I love the most. <laughs> He's like, what the fuck is happening? Are you Ceausescu's greatest hits or what? What do you listen to? I was like, no, I love Ina. I was like, okay, why do you love Ina? So well, I am from Bangladesh, and in Bangladesh it is illegal to watch porn. And that is why I watch the Ina video. <laughs> no, 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 fine. <laughs> That's an Ina song, but nobody got it. Okay, so very good. Uh, you see this shirt? I'm doing merch at the moment, so I'm trying to sell this in Eastern Europe. And I was like, I'm like I have a small, I, I do smart jokes. I'm gonna do a shirt that says communism with cum in it, because it's funny, right? And then three people have asked me, where is cum university? So you went to cum university? <laughs> you, you studied at cum university? Yes, I majored in, in, in s and This is a little blunder mistake on my side over there. Nobody gets the communism side, but everybody seems I'm a student of cum. This is... <laughs> Not wrong, actually. <laughs> hey guys, how's it going? This is Dragush, uh, straight from the stage. Wanted to thank you a lot for watching this video. If you guys did enjoy the video, please do subscribe, like, and comment. And also watch some of my other videos. I've got a bunch of videos throughout this whole channel, so I hope you guys enjoy it. Thank you, and see you in the next one.